I am your host, the leader of BSW, Bill. BSW. Push! Hello, all my VSWville members. How you doing? It is your boy, VSW, and today I'm going to be giving all of you my predictions for tomorrow night's WWE pay-per-view, Money in the Bank. Okay, right here, I'm going to start with the SmackDown Live Women's Championship, where Naomi will defend against the ravishing Lana. So as you may know, after Shane revealed the Women's Money in the Bank briefcase, which looked all right, the ravishing Lana finally arrived on SmackDown, I guess trying to get in the Money in the Bank ladder match, which, of course, I would have known that Lana wouldn't have won the match anyway if she had was to have been in the match. But she said that she could beat Naomi. So later on in the match, while the sixth women tag team match was going on, Lana came out and attacked Naomi, costing the faces the match. So afterwards, Naomi went to Shane's office asking him or demanding to let her face Lana at Money in the Bank and even have her put the women's title on the line. So Shane accepting it, and it's official now. This Sunday at Money in the Bank, Lana will get her title shot against Naomi. Now, even though Lana didn't really do much and isn't really doing much with her new gimmick, at least, unlike Emelina, she is doing something. Because Emelina, she just came out, said she's going to go back to Emma and just walk back off. But Lana, at least she did something. But anyway, it's now official. Tomorrow night at Money in the Bank, it'll be Naomi versus Lana for the SmackDown Women's Championship. Now, who do I think is going to win? Who do I think is going to walk out as the SmackDown Women's Champion? Plain and simple. I think that Lana is going to feel the glow and Naomi is going to walk out still the SmackDown Women's Champion. If Lana somehow wins the title and becomes the first ever ravishing SmackDown Women's Champion, it will be a major upset. But we'll see what happens. But for now, my prediction, Naomi to retain the Women's Championship. Next, we have the first ever Women's Money in the Bank ladder match where Charlotte, Tamina, Carmella, Natalia, and Becky will make history. Of course, it was starting on SmackDown as a fatal five-way elimination match to determine who would challenge Naomi for the SmackDown Women's Championship at Money in the Bank, but all five women just beat the crap out of each other and the match didn't even start it because the bell never rang. So they all beat up Shane McMahon, the commissioner came out and announced the first ever women's Money in the Bank ladder match. So I could pretty much see and tell that this is one of the reasons why, to me at least, SmackDown is better than Raw, because at least the women on SmackDown are the ones who is making history. The very first five women to ever compete in a Money in the Bank ladder match, and it's going to go down tomorrow night at Money in the Bank, SmackDown's pay-per-view. So, who do I see walking out of Money in the Bank as the first ever Miss money in the bank now let me see i would say becky lynch because she is the first ever smackdown women's champion and i like her but i don't think she's gonna win carmella the f-a-b-o-l-o-u-s princess of staten island uh, and i almost spelled fabulous wrong now I, even though I don't see her winning the Money in the Bank briefcase either, I can't deny that she may be a SmackDown Women's Champion one day. Tamina, I don't think she has won a championship in WWE. I could be wrong, but I don't think she did. And I don't think she'll win either. And Charlotte Flair, the woo! Daughter of the Nature Boy, who is one of my 20 favorite superstars of all time. Now, yeah, she was best known for her time with Raw as a 
villain and she was a great villain and Raw Women's Champion and I definitely do see her as a SmackDown Women's Champion one day. I definitely do see that but I don't think I see her winning the briefcase either. So with that my prediction is that the very first Miss Money in the Bank will be Natalia. Next is the five male Money in the Bank ladder match where current United States champion and new face of America Kevin Owens will take on Dolph Ziggler, Shinsuke Nakamura, Baron Corbin, and Sami Zayn in the male Money in the Bank ladder match. Now, of course, none of them became Mr. Money in the Bank except Dolph Ziggler, who cashed in on Raw on the injured Alberto Del Rio to win the World Heavyweight Championship. Nobody else became Mr. Money in the Bank who was in this match. So, of course, this is going to be a fun one to watch, an interesting one, but for me, this is going to be a hard one because I'm not certain on who's going to win. If I know one thing, I know the winner will not be Kevin Owens. Besides, he is already the U.S. champion. And even though he is a former NXT and Universal and Intercontinental champion, I don't see him as Mr. Money in the Bank or a WWE World Champion yet. So I know he's not going to win. Baron Corbin, Andre the Giant Memorial Battle Royal winner. Not of this year, but a previous one. As even though I do see him as a WWE Champion one day, I don't see him as Mr. Money in the Bank either. Shinsuke Nakamura, New Japan Pro Wrestling legend and former two-time NXT Champion. Now, yeah, he is one of the greatest Japanese wrestlers of all time, if not the greatest. Again, best known for his time with NXT and New Japan Pro Wrestling. Even though SmackDown ended with him climbing the ladder and getting the briefcase, I don't think I see him becoming Mr. Money in the Bank either. So for me, it'll either be Dolph Ziggler or Sami Zayn. Dolph Ziggler, yeah, he became Mr. Money in the Bank before, but I don't think he's going to do it again this year. So that means that for tomorrow night's Money in the Bank pay-per-view, my prediction is that Mr. Money in the Bank will be... Sammy Zayn. Next is the SmackDown Live Tag Team Championship match where the Usos will defend against the New Day, who of course you may know is the longest reigning WWE World Tag Team Champions in WWE history. With, of course, Cesaro and Sheamus being the guys to finally end their tag team title reign. So with the Superstar shakeup, the New Day was moved to SmackDown Live. And after showing up on Talking Smack, they finally showed up on SmackDown Live. So now the match it is official. It'll be the New Day challenging the Usos for the SmackDown Tag Team titles this Sunday at Money in the Bank. Now, do I see the New Day as the WWE SmackDown Live World Tag Team Champions one day? Yes. Do I see them as the champions this Sunday at Money in the Bank? Nah. New Day, I like you, but I don't think you're going to be able to do it tomorrow night at Money in the Bank. So, with that, my prediction is that the Usos will walk out of Money in the Bank, still the SmackDown Live Tag Team Champions, because, like they say, it is not paranoia, it's the Usos. And now, ladies and gentlemen, the moment you have all been waiting for, the WWE Championship match between the current champion, the modern-day Maharaja, Jinder Mahal, will defend against this year's Royal Rumble winner, the Viper, Randy Orton. 
Now, of course, as you may know, at Backlash, Jinder Mahal pulled a major upset, defeating Randy Orton and winning his first ever championship in the WWE, which again was shocking, at least to me. Of course, with some interference by the Sin Brothers. So, tomorrow night at Money in the Bank, Randy Orton will get his chance to win his WWE Championship back. From the modern day Maharaja. Now, it's going to be in Randy Orton's hometown in St. Louis, Missouri. And he's going to try to not let his hometown down. So, can he do it? I don't know. Because with him being this year's Royal Rumble winner and a multiple time WWE champion, anything's possible and he can do it. Because who knows? He can hit the RKO out of nowhere at any point. But for me, I don't think it's going to happen. So my prediction for this match is that the winner and still the WWE champion will be the modern day Maharaja. Gender Mahal. And those are VSW's 2017 Money in the Bank predictions. What are your predictions? What do you think is going to happen? Who do you think will win their matches? Let me know down in the comments below. And if you would like to see more videos like this one, then be sure to like, comment, and elbow that subscribe button. Now before I go, I'd like to apologize for once again using the web camera, but don't worry, I'll have a better camera or an HD camera sometime down the road. I can't promise when, but I'll have it sometime. And with that, Monday or Tuesday, I'll be sharing with all of you my Money in the Bank review. Will I like it? Will I dislike it? To me, will it be good? Will it be bad? Will it rock? Will it suck? You'll find out Monday or Tuesday. Until then, this is the future wrestling world heavyweight champion saying, God bless, take care, stay safe, and welcome to VSWville. We are professional wrestling fans forever, and that's the bottom line. Because V.S.W. said so. Fist bump. Push.